Today you will witness the pinnacle of power, intrigue, and splendor, the Roman rule through the eyes of one of the most magnificent rulers in history, Julius Caesar. Prepare to explore the era that shaped the way of life for thousands of people. Today, we're exploring one of the most exciting periods of the Roman Empire and the Roman Republic. Throughout these centuries-long epochs, we've witnessed the rise and fall of mighty leaders, military campaigns that shaped continents, and political intrigues echoing through eternity. In this video, we delve deep into the past, following key events and figures that defined the Roman Republic and transformed it into the powerful Roman Empire. However, this time, we'll be using brief reminders of the most important moments, allowing us to quickly identify crucial events. Please let us know in the comments if there are any of the mentioned events you would like us to explore in more detail in one of our upcoming videos. 60 BC In Rome, the first triumvirate between Crassus, Pompey the Great, and Julius Caesar was established, marking a political alliance among them. 58 BC Caesar achieved a significant victory in the Gallic Wars against the Helvetii and Germans, and was appointed proconsul in Cisalpine Gaul, Illyria, and Transalpine Gaul. 56 BC Caesar expanded Roman authority into present-day France and Belgium, and reconciliation occurred between Crassus and Pompey the Great at the Triumvirate meeting in Lucca, further strengthening political stability in Rome. Subscribe so you don't miss any episode of our journey through history. 55 BC. Pompey the Great and Marcus Crassus were elected consuls, with Pompey receiving control of Hispania and Crassus receiving Syria. 54 BC. Caesar embarked on a military campaign to Britain, while Crassus launched a campaign in Mesopotamia, resulting in the Battle of Cary. 53 BC. The Battle of Cary took place, in which the Parthians defeated the Roman army, and Marcus Crassus was killed. 52 BC Caesar defeated the Gauls in the Battle of Elysia, suppressing the Gallic Uprising, and the First Triumvirate disintegrated. Around 50 BC Julius Caesar documented his conquest of Gaul in his commentaries. 49 BC Caesar crossed the Rubicon and marched on Rome, triggering the Second Roman Civil War. 48 BC Caesar defeated Pompey's supporters in the Battle of Ilerda and was declared dictator. From 47 BC to 45 BC, civil war raged in Rome, and the Alexandrian War began. 46 BC, the Battle of Thapsus took place, and Caesar was declared dictator. 45 BC, Caesar defeated Pompey's supporters in the Battle of Munda. 44 BC, the Senate declared Caesar dictator for life, and he was assassinated, triggering the Third Roman Civil War. 43 BC, Gaius Octavius, Marcus Emilius Lepidus, and Mark Antony formed the Second Triumvirate, marking a political alliance among them. 42 BC, the Battle of Philippi was fought in Macedonia, where Octavian and Mark Antony defeated Republican forces, strengthening their political position. 40 BC, the Senate appointed Herod the Great as King of Judea, further expanding Roman domination in the Middle East. 39 BC, Mark Antony regained territories seized by the Parthians at the start of the Second Parthian War, stabilizing the situation in the East. 36 BC, Mark Vipsanius Agrippa defeated Sextus Pompey in the battles of Mylae and Nolicus, securing the Triumvir's authority. 31 BC, the Battle of Actium took place between Octavian on one side and Cleopatra and Mark Antony on the other. The death of Mark Antony and Cleopatra marked the end of the Second Roman Civil War and the end of Egypt's political power. 30 BC, Egypt became a Roman province after Octavian's victory, and Octavian became the undisputed ruler of the Roman Empire under the name Augustus, marking the end of the era of great conquests and the beginning of stable rule. 27 BC, Octavian formally established the Roman Empire, marking the end of the Roman Republic and the beginning of a new political era. 23 BC, Octavian, now known as Augustus, was granted the title of Imperium Maius, signifying his absolute authority as emperor. 19 BC, 
Augustus compiled a new list of senators, increasing their number to 600, with himself positioned at the top as Princeps Senatus, leader of the Senate. He also established a new form of rule called the Principate. 19 BC, Augustus fully subdued Hispania, expanding Roman rule to the Iberian Peninsula. From 16 BC to 15 BC, the Roman Empire achieved significant victories over Germanic tribes, resulting in the expansion of the empire to the Elba River. From 12 BC to 7 BC, Tiberius, the future emperor, conquered Pannonia and ventured into the province of Germania to suppress the revolt of Germanic tribes and strengthen Roman presence on the northern borders of the empire. As the stars slowly begin to light up the sky above Rome, we cannot help but think about the bravery and determination Julius Caesar displayed in his battles. But did you know that innovation in military engineering was one of the keys to his success? Yes, Caesar was a genius when it came to developing new tactics and techniques for conquering enemy territories. One of the most fascinating stories is about his bridge over the Rhine. When he decided to cross this mighty river to conquer the Germanic tribes, many thought it was impossible. But Caesar was no ordinary military leader. He mobilized his engineers and soldiers and built a wooden bridge in record time, allowing his army to cross the river and seize enemy territory. This move not only showcased Caesar's courage and determination but also became a symbol of his ability to think outside the box and use innovative strategies to win. And so, as we descend into the twilight of ancient Rome, let this story remind us of the power of human will and the ability to overcome challenges. As Caesar demonstrated, even the toughest tasks can be accomplished when intelligence, courage, and determination are used. Let this story be an inspiration for all of us to dream big and bravely face the challenges life presents us. For as Caesar himself said, there are no easy paths to any worthy achievement. In that spirit, may the light of the past guide our path into the future. At the end, we kindly ask you to support our work. Your opinion means a lot to us, so please leave a comment below the video, like it if you enjoyed it, subscribe to our channel to stay updated on future content, and share the video with your friends and family. Your support helps us continue creating quality and inspiring content like this. Thank you for being part of our community.